Here we go, guys. Feats right again. Day after day, playing this game. I'm trying to beat this first episode of the first game. There's three games. Up to five, day two, investigation. This is gonna be a long episode, guys. This is probably gonna be the longest episode I will record of this series, so be ready for that. Uh, actually, I don't know you're here, here still. February 23rd, 2.15 p.m., Brighton Kill Offices. The case anyway. I, I'm a little confused. Huh? Well, well uh, let's see. What's going on? The victim detective Bruce Goodman was stabbed to death so at the 5 p.m. on the 21st. He doesn't prosecute prosecutors parking lot and the police department's evidence. What's this and the evidence room part? Prosecutors, sir. The prosecutor's office and police department at 30 minutes apart from my car. Well, that's what we're trying, going to find out. Our child Alright, let's do it. Uh, glad she's in good spirits. I'm not so sure she's going to help. Be much help with this. Don't be so sure, Mr. Wright. Huh? Look, we're in this together, right? I'll prove that these thick random glasses of mine aren't just for show. Let's go. Science. Something. Here, 23rd prosecutor's office, I don't parking lot. You know, I really don't think we should worry about the police department. It wasn't even a body found there, who cares? Yeah, it was only our victim that was killed in there. So, no biggie. Besides, we just would never do such a thing, I know it. Uh, the oil drum. Is it empty? The oil drum, the door, yeah, it was empty. Sister releasing evidence of the crime scene? Never. So she says they don't get along and they really like her sister. No, it's not at all. It's just a professional professionals and what we do and I trust her. The ghost room is supposed to. Although there was blood on the floor, no, I don't know. I'll jump in the shower wipe. Let's check this out. The science here. I'm going to cut it almost right. Huh? What's that? Grand floor. Situation loss. One thing and that is luminol testing fluid. This stuff is amazing. L luminol? Basically, I'm pretty sure she's gonna explain it better than I can, but luminol is a liquid you can put onto any kind of surface and it will show if there was blood or not. Exactly, you can't wash blood away too easily. It takes a while. Blood is sticky stuff, you know, you can't just wash away with a little water. Even if you can't see it, it's still there. Yep. When the police have already done those tests, never trust anyone else's eye, anyone's eyes but your own, Mr. Wright. So give me a try. Me? I don't want to have to do it. I don't mind, I can't even drink yet. I'm testing blood stains with this stuff, but I'm drinking it. Hey, look, I'll lend you these glasses. Huh? You got a nice pair of those things? Okay. Test for blood reaction, just spray the luminol on it. Like this, see? Press the button, spray it on. That's not some blood stains. I know it's gonna be on the ground, I just wanna double check the car. There we go. I can see her eyes shining on her glasses. So, is this a blood stain? Uh, it's a. Uh, I'm ear shaking. It's just this is my first time seeing real blood. Scientific investigating. Investigation in action. Uh, okay, well, we definitely know that this is a blood stain. Doesn't something strike you as odd? Scientifically speaking, of course. What's odd about this? Scientifically. The amount of blood? You think there'd be more. Perpetrator and detective. Uh, perpetrator and detective Goodman fought here, right? Do you think there'd be a little more blood? I definitely think so. I mean, look at all the. A lot of them saw the victim too. It's pretty strange. They fought here, there had to be more blood than this. Uh, hey, Mr. Wright. I'm gonna mark up the floor plans so and find the blood. Blood sand, okay? Okay. 
Dance for Dandy time around, right? Uh, yeah, I just stuck for Dandy too. So let's see if I'm on the cloud. Look at the sky. Blue shades, right? Blue shades. I wonder how that fluid of yours would react to a nice deli box. A star. Oh, not you. Oh, I trust your own eyes, man. Not bad, you two. This day, old deli bots is on the house. Sorry, just that kind of lead in. Oh, sorry, just that kind of lead in it doesn't really get my mouth watering. Okay. Can you screw off today, child? You still ain't put me in a tight spot today. My apologies for sorry, but. No, no, it's okay. It was my fault. Oh, no. I wouldn't say everything in a second. The security room weren't there. I was afraid that one well, second went to the see. I just wanted to think that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You lied on the witness stand. That's unforgivable. He eats. Uh, little girl, don't forget what's important here. Even the place I witnessed the events from was different. I still saw what I saw. I saw Chief Prosecutor Sky stab a man in cold blood, and that's when he still stands. I swear to my own as a detective, she stabbed Goodman. Why would she stab Goodman? No, they work together. That's a girl has Detective Star. Ugh, so you were a detective when you were a star. Yes, long time ago. A few years ago. No matter how. No matter how hard the crime is, I think. No matter how hard the crime is, how hard the crime is, they faced me. They coughed it up. They coughed it up. They confessed. They bowed like babies. You know? I may seem like a demon sometimes, like me. Every time, every day I drive the dirt of the hospital, suspect, suspect. For a long, they called me the cough up queen. Oh, and yeah, I thought so, and I got food poisoning in lunches. You were let go, uh, fired. I thought I found my dream job when I became a prosecutor. If these prime and proper prosecutors had let me go, it'd still be one today. That. Well, because of that case, yes, I'm not interested. Wait, who's that? Isn't that not the one warning? Oh my god. 
323rd Police Department entrance. It's even busier here today than it was yesterday. The detectives are running around so fast and blurry. I suppose it makes sense. The detectives are killed here after all. So they haven't seen the same time. According to the pamphlet, we are at the front desk. Here it is. This is the good kid in the amusement park. Ooh, a real crime scene. Let's go take a look. I mean, what weird is that with the real crime scene? But okay. Federal Affairs Department. Here we are again. Ooh, guard station. There was a vicious murder of a detective down at the police department. Yes, so the same detective was also killed at the same time as possibly was fought. First things first, let's go check out the police department crime scene. Yes, he's found dead, so I have a mystery. But don't mess up, or will you could wind up dead. If anyone wants more mysteries or dead bodies right here, right now. But it doesn't look like anyone's going to help as much either. I actually want to go outside and look at this old guard station thing. It's over here. Okay, oh, I know who's here. What's with the decor? This is very eccentric. Come to the pamphlet, this is the guard station of the evidence room. So beyond that door is the evidence room. The scene of the crime. So it seems that way. Oh, no. Is it wrong? It's it. Those cracked eyes. They're so prickly, it's all posing it. It's hard to think straight. Okay, the cacti sail the desert. What I want to know is if this is a guard station, where's the guard? I don't feel like I know who he is already. Yeah, I know who it is. I just don't want to see the guard, honestly. It's my thing. I just want to not deal with the guard. The guard station. Okay. Any point in examining? Oh, there's a lot of stuff in here to look at. The wise or a rope? What kind of floor? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, it looks like a setup or to trap something. A trap here? Wait, I know. Maybe someone was trying to catch a wild bull in here, but the last one is. You should have an active imagination. Okay. Camera. Or computer. Look, there's a video feed on the evidence from here. There's a light behind the monitor. This is a recording. I bet we can use this computer to check out some of it in and out later. Yeah. Oh wait, what? Cacti have only been for sister. Case foot in a cold. Bridget shell, it's my play in three directions. I'm not so sure I see those other ones. So I'm not too thinking for the similarity. Maybe there's another way in through here. Two wings after the line. Yeah, they arrested a suspect, but I don't know who that suspect is. Uh, I'm parking lot. Do I have to talk to her? Present something. Not the guy. Not the guy. Oh, I had one two years ago. Should be so sure. Okay. Let me take a look at this. Oh, Bye. 
good was nice stuck in it, which I'm sorry. He has been his gratitude. Gratitude. If I had one, he's fine. So Let's see, could you take a look at this? I just skipped past it. Huh. <laughs> I was only got the cheap prosecutor on the shoulder. She dropped that phone on payback. That's when you heard her talking about the muscle, right? Where did I know? If the trap, the cars will throw the most years spread on the floor. What's this guy really trying to say, I wonder? Represent that she's probably just gonna talk about no. Nope. She's probably would talk a little bit. No, it's. Think about it, I could have taken that picture in the guard room. We're gonna make it flushed to the house. She went straight to the table. I'm gonna show the chain link fence in the left and stuff in order. I don't think so, yeah, it's in the right, so it's in the right. Oh, No new evidence. There you go, that's not an answer. The answer really opened my eyes to the truth. The truth of what? Well, nothing to them. Disposable. Disposable to who? Two years ago, it was the biggest case I'd ever handled. Okay. Please and the prosecutors are desperate for decision, decisive evidence, so they didn't solve it. On the contrary, it was solved quite cleanly. The criminal was caught and executed. Executed. It's a criminal guy who's coming in. Doesn't get any clear of that. No problem with it. They never did find a slice of evidence. Not a shred. Oh, but the criminal was executed, right? On the basis of evidence of a sword made of evidence. What? You mean they execute someone without, with fabricated evidence? That's fucking several months after the trial. Every detective involved with the case. Dealt with. Some were demoted to patrolmen, others found themselves to have a job. You were one of those. Myself and one other person you know well. Could it be who? Exactly. Jake Marshall. Who's the police department security detail officer? Who? Jake Marshall. Detective Marshall. As professional detectives, we investigated that case from every angle. Jake was particularly determined. Then it was over, and he was smart. However, he hadn't forgotten, and neither have I. You haven't forgotten that's on hide? There was another side to that case, a hidden side that we're. That's what we're after now. You know what up in the fancy offices can stop us. Wait, that, those lunches you sell. There is only one reason I kept so much as this at the first office. I come here to meet old friends, boyfriends, I can help me best these. Ooh, it's not for the boyfriends, I did she have anyway. Small detectives on this one, I have disappeared to find new evidence. Must be a connection. So, rookie. Oh, what? Seems like you're serious about investigating this case. Yeah, obviously. You should take this. Sounds very steak lunch. I know some guy who might help if you tempt him with this cheat. Oh, he's gonna start. That's some pretty 
Officer Marshall is good, dude. Are you going out? No. What do you want to know? I was just wondering what happened to him. A long time ago when he was helping. Notifications, please. My sister, do cases, he was so nice. Yeah, mom. So well, my sister. And he was nice to meet you back then. This would be one of the most of the detectives. Now, nice and cool. Taking the early cooperatives, I see the great past to rest as if there were nothing more than that. Uh, I see. Thank you. Mr. Jake Marshall. Okay, nowhere to go. Let me check if Edgeworth is at his office. So this is a classic day, so as I said, I'm going to be sure this now. Okay, he's not here. That's all I was trying to figure out if the truth was here or not. If he was, it could have helped us out. So he's just starting with the fancy guarantee as always. Please! Huh? What's that? One stick punch, please. Oh, it's to you. Except for one stick. Now's the time for chit chat, pal. I'm, bu I'm a busy man. What do I need is a steak lunch from Lunchland. Oh, you need one of these? Actually, it's not for sale. I think I just heard the sound. The sound is heartbreaking. Now's the time for despair. We caught up Corona. We just need evidence. Corona, you mean. You heard about the stabbing in the police department? Evidence, you right, pal? Yeah, we heard it. We were in there, during the case. It's the biggest scandal to hit the station in ages. Everything's topsy turvy. But it's actually going see. Who was it? This is about all I need. All I know is I need me a stink lunch front. So, standing around here talking isn't gonna fill my belly. Well, wait, don't leave. If you want to know more, head on down to the tent center, pal. I think should be over soon. Okay. Yeah, that's what I don't do. Start. Okay. Well, let's go to the guard station. No one's here. Okay, cool. If I go in here, I should you just go straight to the tension here? So we're trying to turn the tension So do you feel better about things a little? I mean, they caught the person who stabbed the governor, didn't they? Uh, yeah, I guess they did. Let's not go too far down that road right now. Things will just get confusing. Oh no. I know who that is. So that's what I'm saying, he a perpetrator? I, I I'd say I was I, I I was the perpetrator again, sir. That's what I'd say. Yep. Uh oh, uh hi. Greetings, sir. Meekins, right? Officer Meekins, yep. So you're a, good, you're a guard here at the tension. No, sir, I'm not, sir. I'm lost patrolman, like a little lost lamb, sir. Oh, yeah, you're here to deliver a report. No, sir, I, uh, how should I say this? Wait, is he, is it, is he? You, Officer Meekins, you didn't do it. You didn't, did you? Uh, perpetrator Officer Meekins reporting, sir. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Now, this is not such a term for that, so okay. Day of the crime. Sir, I'm a patrolman with General Affairs, sir, sir. Ow, I can hear you fine, Officer Meekins. I had some business that day, sir. And so I went to the evidence room, sir. The guard station in front of the room was empty, sir. God, this dude's so annoying. If only there's a guard at the evidence room. That's right, sir. Because the evidence kept in the evidence room, sir. That security officer is none other than Officer Marshall. Uh, Marshall? So I happened to glance at the security uh, room monitor. That's what I saw him, sir. A suspicious person in the evidence room. A suspicious person, sir. A suspicious evidence. Yeah. Oh. Is this 
what I do and what happened then. After that sir, I went I I I everything went black. Or everything went white. I saw red, I blacked out. And when I came to I was here on the tension center. How long did you wait out, days? Um when I ask, what happened to your hand? Sir, there was no one to banish me, sir. Okay. So I did what I could to wrap it up, sir. Banish on his hand. Just like my sky. You got another similarity between the case and the one at the prosecutor's office. First things first, tell us how you hurt your hand. Uh, yeah. Fire your hand. Did that happen during the course of the crime? Well, you see, sir, I, uh, don't even think of anything you just confess, but sir, 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 but there's nothing I could do. Nothing you could do. Sir, to tell the truth, sir, it wouldn't have happened. The detective pointed that knife at me. I just hollered, sir. That's saying I knew I was unconscious. That's saying I knew you were. Huh? Then when I opened my eyes, I was alone in the evidence room, sir, all alone. Well, because the detective government has disappeared. Then when I looked down, I was gushing blood from my hand, sir. Oh, the shock. Oh, the sorrow, sir. Can you imagine how I felt? I some spy disappeared. That's some story. Okay, the victim. I mean, probably, but you're the perpetrator, correct? You can't text for this guy by the answer, Sir, please don't look at me with the sad puppy dog eyes, sir. Don't enable me victim. I'm out. Um, I would, but you happen to be in tension and alive and whatnot. That, uh, yes. Well, that's true. That's true, sir. That's what you can say that. You know the victim, Detective Goodman. Well, sir, if I had to label him as a stranger or a total stranger, I'd say he's an Italian total stranger. So you didn't know, sir. I work in the science department, devoid of light or other comforts. I don't know any detectives. Okay. So he was a total stranger. Why did you stab him? Sir, I had n no intention of killing him, no, sir. None. N nor do I have any recollection of recollection, the no, recollection of uh, k k killing him, sir. Uh, at least someone be around here is one of the reason I am. Maybe I can show some evidence. Um, do you think you can look at this? Hey, that's it, sir. That's it. That's it. That's what. I was a blank until this very moment. So now I remember, I remember so. You mean, look what happened? Correct, that card. That card is the closet. D card? Exactly, sir. That's exactly it. Nothing could be more. I'm clear of prime, so it's a little low deeper. Scared him nice. Okay, I just wanted to look at it. That's the third last night. That's the one. I was an apple. I was an apple, sir, in my dream, sir, and I was being peeled. One second. I thought you don't have to look at the knife. He's overreacting on that knife, but I guess he's been through a lot. Uh, at least this is shorter than the other one. Let's make it seem to get through this. No? Does he know anything? I'm getting like no info on this dude. Oh my god, bro. Why do you have that? That's from the day. It was sitting in the prosecutor's office. The day that detectives that detective Goodman's body was found in the trunk. So this means this means I'm a free man, innocent. It's a dream, sir. Don't have to wake up. It's a dream. You better wake up right now. Okay, 
I'm just kind of showing them everything. Wait. Have I actually looked at this yet? Make sure it's not like messed up or anything. And we haven't gotten any more crime details. Can you tell me what it is you do remember? Well, sir, you might say I'm a little lost patrolman and lost the land as well. Okay. I didn't know, sir, going with him in the evidence room. That's why you thought he looked suspicious. Sir, I answered the evidence room and asked the man to send his ID card. That sounds weird, so I've looked so far. But that's right, sir. That's what I've been trying to tell you. So I asked him for his ID card. That's the thing, someone you point a knife at me. Once. Sir, I assure you I was as flustered as you are right now. So I whooped and left him at him. I took them and pointed a knife at him. Don't know others before they do the undo before they do onto you. My own father's word, sir. What happened then? Well, when I sir, everything went white and I loved was here. <laughs> So we didn't know until we got in. That's only a met at the scene of the crime. It says ID card. In other words, we know a way to know a victim for a victim. And if this body just disappears in the ocean, we don't know if it has to be or not. Huh? You saw it up here? I thought that it had been. It had to be him, sir. But they had the time. You know, it's definitely the other answer. They don't really want to clearly. Man, I'll the videotape this quick here. Huh? Videotape? Let's see the camera. The crime, my crime, the crime. I swore to stamp out. It's there. It's me on tape. Huh. Really, though, you wait till now to tell us this stuff? So now, I'm going to go to the Criminal Affairs Department. Dang it, bro. Police Chief Grant. Okay. Are you sure this is all? Hmm? You know what it means? If there's anything missing? Sir, I'm sure it's most likely totally perfect. We checked all of us. Let's see this one. I see. Well, if anything is right turn up, you call me right away, do you? Y yes, sir. Let's go to the place. Uh huh, right on, my boy. How you been? Swim much? Uh, Chief Grant. Again, reporting for duty, sir. Why are you sleeping in this, right? Bro, look at him. I ain't trying to get my butt raped. This is gonna rape me. Edward. I'm just, I'm just going to be okay. Oh, Worthy? Oh, you know, they're doing a little query with him. Since they're in position. Yeah. Oh, yep. Well, they had no end of trouble with the bodies of the boys since last year. I mean, the incident for the. It doesn't look, like, it doesn't look good having the top prosecutors in the defendant's seat, does it? And you, you got some. It's a nice one, guilty in that case, right, Ryder? Von Karm! The true evil! Yeah. A legend to his son. Undefeated in his 40 year career. But in court, he fixed it, so he was caught for forging evidence. Wait, I didn't do anything wrong, he did forge evidence. In any case, the, prosecu the prosecutor's office is in a bit of a turmoil, you might say. Why? They just. What they do just about anything to restore their reputation. And if anyone wants that inquiry committee decides, it could be bad for Worthy. But what? Evidence yeah, for an incident. It's not where you are, I tell you. They're just getting killed on the turf, too. Yeah, 
there being the consequences. So I guess speaking is possible. It's possible, yeah, I know that. Yes, but that's what I'm going to say. I'm going to get stabbed in two locations at the same time. That's what it says. What is this? No, 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 right -o. I can't get to skip all the way or see could take that. This, in particular, well, it's a little sensitive. I can't talk about it. So I can just say, like, you know, one thing I hate most of all is hiring stuff secrets. Can't stand it. You know, it's a full time job. Chief, I can just this trap shot. Uh, he was. He was the one who. He was the one who was on earlier. Uh, you saw that? Whoops. It really was that he wanted the chief to do whatever the detectives to do. To kill him. I'll discreetly ask him. How? There's no new communications unless you have to present something to get in the talk. Ay ay ay, maybe. The knife. You have no comment for the knife, really, bro? What the shoe? There has to be something I can say to get him to talk. If I see you take a look at this and it's done. Oh, you have no comment on the phone.
They lost 221 neighbors going to ID 59. I don't know why. It's... Okay, so he won't even talk about it. Oh, permission to enter. Actually, I was wondering if, you could, if I could ask you a favor. Oh, I never thought that they would come when you might ask me for help. I don't know if we can get can rescue the other's room. No, I don't. Uh, actually, I'm sorry. I, I don't need an rescue after all. Mother, please, do I look like a selfish man? Huh? Yeah, can anyone ask me, sir? Can I borrow $50? I give them $50, no problem. So go ahead, let's get the room where your heart's content. No, so, 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 you never know if you ask. For you here, you can borrow this. That's a special card for guests, so I'm it. Yes, sir, it's not. Howdy, partner. Well, well, what's me and my baby in the sky so great? Come on. Fade in, yep. Uh, Officer Marshall. Why does it have to be him? What's that? Why does it have to be him look for? As you may surmise, this here is my saloon. Um, we're here to investigate the crime scene. Yeah! That car already got the layer on your chest. Better than sheriff's badge in these parts. Well, what are you standing there for? Get along, little dog. It's kind of to wait. Hard to be on again. While we're here, I was wondering if we could ask you some questions. I got what I got in my mind. Take a few memories. You bitch, you like to say that? I'm um, sorry, I didn't wish to speak with you. Because you said you had no one to take those. That's how it is. I don't know if we can talk to you. Jermaine, I don't want the realms of land, so there's no way to I know what to do. Hey, you want this? That smell. Ah, why don't you touch this? So I'll have some Marshall. That's my baby. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm sorry. What's this? Do I say for lunch? I see, I see. I don't see. I don't know what it means. Say for lunch, you're not a social. Our baby, you know, you went. Asked. Mm, lunch. Okay, steak. Good. Well, it seems like. You just want to talk? See who talk about this. Okay, guard station. As a much to you charge of security as a right. You have good eyes, partner. It's an easy job and a way for it. I shall speak. Uh, poor little doggy. Poor guy, I keep getting his name wrong, calling him meekly. He told us something. He, told, he said that when the stabbing occurred, you weren't at your station. Well, maybe I shouldn't be telling you this. But since I got demoted from detective two years ago, well, I might not look it, but I lost my fire for the job, you know. 
So what are you doing around 5.15 in the marketplace? Well, I reckon I was galloping down the highway in the back of my steed, Zippy. No, he was riding down the highway on this horse named Zippy. There's only these people here anyhow. These new thing I'm seeing on a fucking god, bro. Do a bang your job, a cute night out of the place. You need a security camera system? I'll take the machines to lunch. Kinda like that stewed broccoli that's making the nuts too steak now. Bring the scene of the crime. It's all gone now, like you don't want to bring it. Where? You're still investigating that so nine incident I'm sorry, aren't you? That was my case. It's all solved on the record books. It smells like a bad game book. Can't let it go. That's all there is to it. I'm gonna end the episode, guys. Uh, what kind of case was it anyway? We've heard the name so many times, but no one tells us about it. Yeah, but there's some things you see better off not knowing that the case was dead to you. Why'd you leave? I say, why you leave?